government's consistent investment in education has not yet met expectations from the labor market. The business community, and in particular the manufacturing sector, says the quality of local tertiary education is very poor and has resulted in a severe skills shortage. Harold Pupkovitz, a business mogul in his own right and one of the country's top private employers, shared his take on the skill shortage. There is also the question that we can't all be academics and that the blue-collar avenue to success is as promising as the white-collar avenue. And so at school, at a certain stage, whether it's standard four or standard six or grade, whatever you call it, stage, we must separate the two streams, the academic stream and the, shall we call it, the vocational stream. Namibia's plethora of training institutions insist they are producing quality graduates. However, they are looking for guidance from the labor market as to which skills to focus on. The business community has also asked for programs and courses at vocational training centers to be reviewed in accordance with the demand of the labor market. We also need more vocational schools. Let's be practical and build this country. We want to industrialize. We need vocational skills as well as the um, technological skills. In any case, many people start at a certain level. Take even in this country, how many people who were started life as mechanics, trained well, run their own businesses now, employ people, and they are capable, they're successful. The Pupkovitz group employs more than 1,200 people throughout the country and is constantly looking for high skill levels in its employees. While Pupkovic calls for more vocational training centers to be erected all over Namibia, he insists that all VTCs should focus on quality as well as quantity.